And HEB elementary school teachers out of jail on bond tonight after being arrested for indecency, indecency with a child. Police say he victimized two little girls in his classroom while other kids watched. Fox 4's Melissa Cutler is at Bel Air Elementary School in Hearst where that teacher worked. Melissa. And Steve, you know, parents of HEB ISD are devastated. Um, we've had to deal with two educators they have accused of child sex abuse in less than two months. No one answered the door. At a home in the 6900 block of Smithfield Road in North Richland Hills, the last known address for Angel Omar Salas, the 25 year old third grade teacher at Bel Air Elementary School in HEB ISD, was arrested for indecency with a child involving two little girls in his classroom last May. Police believe the girls may have been victimized more than once. We were able to establish probable cause to have two warrants issued for the rest of uh, Mr. Salas for indecency with a child fondling, which involves touching, inappropriate touching, sexual touching of the children. Police say both alleged attacks took place inside Salas's classroom in front of classmates. Police say Salas tried to be discreet, but the kids knew what was going on and told their parents. Parents told the school, CPS, then law enforcement there were initial language barriers. I don't know if they actually saw the full brunt of it all, but they were aware that uh, uh, something odd or out of, out of the ordinary was occurring. HEB ISD released a statement Tuesday, quote, Questions have been asked related to the district's screening process. The district goes beyond the state requirement in screening applicants. The district says it ran Salas's background through an FBI database. County databases and checked his references. There's still some others that uh, they weren't as strong as a case, um, but we do have other victims, but the cases weren't as strong, so we're going to go with two for right now. Salas was ultimately arrested at DFW Airport August 10th after returning to the U.S. from El Salvador. Salas's arrest comes on the heels of another HEB ISD arrest, that of Oscar Figueroa. The former principal of Viridian Elementary School has been indicted by a federal grand jury accused of trying to meet a teenage boy for sex. Now, the district told Salas back on August the 10th that they plan to terminate his contract. He has a right to a hearing, Steve, but so far the district says he has not requested one. All right, Melissa, let me, ask, let me ask you something. Were parents notified? I guess this happened at the end of last year. Were parents notified, parents who had kids at the school, you know, before summer break let out? How did it all play out? Yes, you know, actually, they were notified very quickly. Back on May the 21st, the district says it placed Salas on administrative leave. And then the very next day, they say they put out flyers, they put out letters to third grade parents letting them know what was going on. And then just five days after that, they say that they uh, contacted the State Board of Education Certification in an abundance of caution to let them know what was going on. So the district says that they have tried every step of the way, as much as they could legally, to let parents know what's going was going on at least you know in the school and in that classroom as much as they could okay melissa cutler live tonight in hearst thanks